So I've come down to the cemetery today. Appreciate your family and your friends. Is it wrong to try and speak to somebody that you know, your loved one that has passed? Do you get many visitors? It's my nan and my granddad. Try and talk to them. News in a spirit box. Goodbye, nan. I don't care if people think this is unethical. So I've come down to the cemetery today to uh, clean up my nan and granddad's grave, bring some nice flowers for them, just to make it look nice and um, be a bit cheeky. And I brought my Jensen ghost box. Is that allowed? Are you allowed to speak to spirits in a graveyard that you actually know? Because we as ghost hunters, paranormal investigators, we go in cemeteries all over the place and try and communicate with uh, the dead, as it were. We don't know these people. Is it wrong to try and speak to somebody that you know, your loved one that has passed? My nan and granddad, they're here. Well, their grave is anyway. Is it so wrong to try and talk to them? Am I allowed to speak to my own family? We'll find out. I'm gonna clean it up first, put the flowers in, and go from there. Hi, Nan and Grandad. Do you remember me? I'm Michael, your grandson. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? Very beautiful, nice spring morning. I've cleaned your grave up. Do you like the flowers? Is it lonely here? How did you come? No, I'm not working today. Do you like your flowers? Sat in the middle. So sat in the middle. I am sat in the middle. What colour are your flowers? And I thought. He won't be coming up. Dad will be up at some point over Easter. Your son. Would you like that? John will be up. Come and say hello. Come and bring flowers. What message for Dad do you have? He's gonna, he's gonna be up here at Easter. 
bring in flowers. Snake calf. Is it blue calf? It's got a silver calf. Do you want to talk to me? Yes. Say yes. It's a nice day, isn't it? Do you get many visitors? We can have a chat. If you're still here anyway. You're probably not. Maybe you visit from time to time. Exactly. Exactly. It's a nice cemetery though, isn't it? Very big. Lots of space. Looked after. That's it for the moment. My wife came up here a few weeks ago to clean it up. Do you remember? Great or grave? My daughter Ava, my wife Siggy, they were up here. We all miss you. Nan and Grandad can say goodbye for me. Goodbye. Goodbye, Nan. I can see her eyes. I see her eyes. Goodbye, Grandad. We'll see you another time. So there we go, guys. I'm trying to communicate with my nan and granddad. My granddad passed in 1993. My nan passed in 1995. So it's been a long time. You know, sometimes it's difficult not seeing family. That's the one thing that this pandemic has taught us. Appreciate your family and your friends. And sometimes it's nice just to come to visit your, your family at their grave and think, you know, try and talk to them using a spirit box. Because I want to talk to my family. I don't care if people think this is unethical. It's my nan and my granddad. I'm at their grave. I've kept it nice and clean. I've brought flowers. So, there you go. Anyway, guys, it's just something to think about. I'll see you in the next video. See you later. Be nice to your family.